President David Sassoli, President Charles Michel, honorable members, I am the first woman to be president of the European Commission. I am the president of the European Commission. And this is how I expected to be treated when visiting Turkey two weeks ago, like a commission president. But I was not. I cannot find any justification for what I was treated in the European treaties. So I have to conclude that it happened because I am a woman. Would this have happened if I had worn a suit and a tie? In the pictures of previous meetings, I did not see any shortage of chairs. But then again, I did not see any women in these pictures, neither. I felt hurt and I felt alone as a woman and as a European. Because it is not about seating arrangements or protocol. This goes to the core of who we are. This goes to the values our union stands for. And this shows how far we still have to go before women are treated as equals, always and everywhere. Of course, I know that I am in a privileged position. I am the president of an institution which is highly respected all around the world. And even more important, as a leader, I can speak up and make myself heard. But what about the millions of women who cannot? Women who are heard every day in every corner of our planet, but neither have the power nor hold the office to speak up. When I arrived at the meeting, there were cameras in the room. Thanks to them, the short video of my arrival immediately went viral and caused headlines around the world. There was no need for subtitles. There was no need for translations. The images spoke for themselves. But we all know thousands of similar incidents, most of them far more serious, go unobserved. Nobody ever sees them or hears about them because there is no camera, because there is nobody paying attention. We have to make sure that these stories are told too. And that when they are told, they are acted upon.